Okay, well, if you watched the last video, you saw me have a look at Google Drive and then make a link to a Google document uh, in Firefly. So that was a equivalent of a Word document or a word processing document. So in this video, uh, we're going to explore a few more linking files and we're going to start off, I think, by linking to a presentation. Now I've got a presentation uh, in here. It's a presentation uh, on Mahara, which is an ePortfolio system. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a link to it in uh, Firefly. So just as before, I double click on the file to open it. And I've now got two choices, as you saw if you watched the last video. I can either click on Share here, or I can go to File and Share there. So I'm going to try this one instead. So I'm going to click on Share. And again, I've got options here. Let's see which ones they are. I can um, allow anyone with the link to edit, comment or view. Uh, so I just want the view. So click on view. I want to copy the link. There's no shortcut here. It's now copied to the clipboard. That's good. I can press done. I can now go back into Firefly. Here it is here. Here is my heading. So let's just go to edit it. And I'm just going to write e port oops, e portfolio presentation. There we go. So I'm going to create this into a hyperlink. So I highlight it. I click on the link icon. I've got my file in Google Drive already copied. So I'll paste it in here. Have it open in a new window so I can still see the VLE and press done. My link's made. Let's press done and have a look at it. So if I click on here, this will now take me into my drive and I can actually go and see it working. So I can press present and there we go. There's my first slide, my second slide and so on. So if I press escape to go back. Now, did you notice that it picked up my Google account. So again, what happens if I don't have a Google account? Well, if I sign out like that, I'm just going to close this box. What happens if I try to click on here? I don't have a Google account. There it is. It's saying sign in. That's absolutely fine. I've got my list of slides here. If I click on present, I can still play the presentation, even if I don't have a Google account which is absolutely fantastic. So that is linking to a presentation. Let's go back and try something else. Uh, how about linking to a Google folder? Can I link to a collection of files? Well, let's see. Uh, I'm going to go back to my account. Here it is here. Uh, click on my drive. And I happen to have some important images that I quite like people to see. It's the logos of the school. So can I link to the folder? Well, let's have a look. If I go back to my drive. If I click on the images folder. And if I go to here, it says get link. So if I click on it, it appears to be coming up with a link. I can change the settings. Let's have a look at the settings. Uh, share with others so I can get others to edit so I can put in their address uh, or to view if I just want to get the shareable link I can again allow people the opportunity to edit in that folder or just view I just want view I can copy the link so I'm copying the link to that folder let's go back into Firefly Let's edit this page and then let's just write a sentence. So uh, BSN Senior School Logos folder to files like that. Highlight the words I want to make into the hyperlink. Press the link, paste in the file, open in a new window and press done. Let's see what happens. Let's click done here. So I'm going to click on this link 
and sure enough it goes into my folder you can see again I can still see the images even though I don't have in this case a Google Drive account and can I what can I do with them well, if I right click I can save the image to them uh, and I can open them in a different tab and so on and so forth so I can link to a folder just like with OneDrive and then the final thing is can I link to a form a Google form so I might have a survey that I want people to fill in can I link to that form well let's give it a go let's go back uh, I press done and I think I've got a form here let's have a look uh, in here yeah I've got a form here which is quite interesting this is a form from my uh, year 12 tutor group so I want to take that form into and link to uh, Firefly so if I click on it and double click to open it and I should as before have the share area now that's interesting I don't have the shared area there if I click on file I don't have the share feature there so what do I do well I do appear to have two send forms so let's click on send form and find out what happens and there we go I've got my link to share in fact I can make it into a short URL there we go so if I copy that link and if I go into Firefly and if I go to edit the page and if I just put a new line in I'm just going to say complete this short survey about life in year 12 highlight the words because I want to make this into a hyperlink click on the link icon paste in the short URL that I had I'm going to open it in a new window and press done press done and let's have a look what it looks like here click on here and I should be taken to the Google Doc in fact there we are it's a form the form opens notice how it opens in the complete design I can fill this out yeah I can type in it like that I can select all these things good and I can obviously submit my form so there we go there is a link to a Google form so in this video, I've shown you how you can link to a number of different Google files, how to link to a document, a presentation, an actual folder, and finally a form, probably all the key files that you would link to in Google.